Valentine's Day is just around the corner and many singletons are searching for a date. But if you're particularly interested in dating British girls, then you may need to know exactly what it takes to impress us. Hi guys, Anna English here. This is English Like a Native and if you're looking to improve your English, then you're in the right place. Just be sure to hit the subscribe button and the bell notification button so you don't miss any future lessons. In just a second, I'll be telling you what impresses me as a British woman, but I don't speak for every woman, so I'll be getting out there on the streets to talk to lots of different types of women to find out what impresses them. Can I let you in on a secret? You are already winning. You can speak another language and many girls find that very impressive. Now, if you want to take your language skills a step further, maybe learn a completely different language or just improve the language that you're already learning, then you might be interested in today's sponsor, RIPE. RIPE is an online language learning provider who provide one-on-one -on -one personalized lessons in the following languages, French, German, Spanish, Italian, Mandarin, Arabic, and of course, English. RIPE do handpick all of their tutors so you can be safe in the knowledge that you are learning language from the best of the best. Best of the best. Oh, yeah. But don't take my word for it, the best thing you can do, as always, is to check it out for yourself and then come back and tell us all about your experience. Simply follow the link in the description box below and you'll get access to a seven day trial. Now this is risk free and it all costs one dollar. So for one dollar you can try it out for a whole week and see what you think. If you do go to try, please let me know about it in the comments section below. Okay, so what impresses me? Personally, I love an accent. It might sound strange coming from someone who helps people to reduce their accents, but what I do is make sure that people can communicate effectively, but I still do love a good accent. Funny guys, if you can make me laugh, then pff, nothing else matters. A funny guy is a very attractive guy. Now, of course it helps if you're attractive. If you stay in shape and you have a pretty face, then I'm going to find you attractive. But what I find more attractive than anything else is talent. So if you're talented at something, it doesn't even have to necessarily be a performing based talent. I'm not talking about singing or playing an instrument. I'm talking about just being very good at something. I find that very attractive. People who are top of their game, ahead of the field, and I guess a guy I can rely on and trust, someone who does what they say they're going to do, that's very attractive. Much more attractive than someone who says they're gonna call you and then they don't call you, or agrees to pick you up at 8.30 and then doesn't turn up till nine. Mm, I don't like that. Now there are just a few things that impress me, but let's find out what the other ladies find attractive. What, would you, what, what, what would a guy have to do to impress you? <laughs> well, he has already done it. He's just bought me a new car, so without me knowing, he just came home with a new car for me. How's that? So nice, expensive surprises. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and you? What do you think? Oh, he gets up in the middle of the night and lets the dog out. Uh, so the, the dog wants stuff. So yeah, yeah. The, the little things. Yeah. So, something interesting, surprising. Um, something that I don't know. It's taken thought. Um, that you can tell it's taken a bit of time. Uh, out of their day just to be something special for you? Definitely not too coffee. Not too coffee? Yeah, if they're too coffee then it's a no-go. Um, also, just showing that you care for little things. So a morning text to me just makes my day. Okay. Or a good night text as well. But when they show that they're, you know, not interested, always wanting to be with the boys, then no. <laughs> See ya. Okay. So Go it's the little things it's and not too things. arrogant. Yeah, not too arrogant. Definitely really not. So what impresses me yeah. about? I think if somebody was just a little bit more thinking out of the box and did something alternative rather than a dozen red roses, which although they're lovely, they're uh, a little bit boring. Okay, so something unique. Something, something a little more bit personal. different personal to me, exactly. 
teddy bears and, and flowers. Mm. Nothing soppy? No, no, not, yeah, nothing soppy, but I've always wanted to be presented with some really nice lingerie. That would be my ultimate. <laughs> oh, yeah, that would be nice. <laughs> Fabulous. Okay. Fantastic. Thank you to those ladies who did agree to appear in this video. I hope you guys found it helpful. If you did, then please show us your thumb. Oh, and don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Lots of impressive things going on in Instagram. So come and join me there. It's free. Why not? <laughs> All right, guys, take care. Have a marvelous, love filled Valentine's Day. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.